Hi, uh, I would just like to give you a quick update on the Miracast project. So since the last video, I've made numerous improvements to the project, um, including improving the frame rate, um, improving audio video sync, and um, I would like to make one correction for my last video. So I claim that the, uh, the artifacts were caused by packet loss. That's actually not true. Um, I did a Wireshark capture on the endpoint, and then uh, Wireshark convenient provided a uh, packet loss analysis tool based on RTP sequence ID, I believe. And um, it only showed that roughly 0.5% packet loss throughout the system. So it's actually really good. So Wi-Fi Direct is actually fairly good. Well, granted, I'm assuming that the endpoints have been fairly close together, but regardless, 0.5 is fairly impressive in my books. Um, so the, the actual artifact was caused by me misinterpreting the MPEG-2 transport stream uh, in, uh, in my code. So I passed that all up quite a bit. And um, I just want to show you how it looks right now. So could you focus on the uh, TV? So here. So, um, as you can see, the performance is actually fairly good, very impressive. Um, but you can probably notice that there were still hiccups here and there. Um, again, um, in the last video, I would have told you that it's packed a loss, but at this point, I don't think it is. Um, uh, given that this is running on Linux, so I'm, I'm, my current theory is that there may be some other um, application running in the background, and, and that's displacing my application, causing it to hiccup every so often. And um, another thing is the the, um, the the audio portion of it. Um, what I noticed is the uh, the phone runs is clocked slightly faster than the Pi. So as a consequence to that is there will be a sort of audio buildup in the long run. And um, currently I'm simply dropping the packets off, but I I think that the Omex um, API provides a way for me to oh sorry the the, the OpenMax API provides a way. To, uh, to increase the clock speed just so that I could do the playback a little faster. So I could, should be, well, in theory, I should be able to, um, able to adjust um, sort of the latency and the dynamically in a run, at runtime instead of dropping the packets off. So that should lead to potentially a better experience. Um, so so again, I mean, it's good, but I'm, I'm still not exactly satisfied with it. So I'm gonna work on it a bit more. Um, so uh, let me know if you have any other questions. Um, to help them or uh, try to answer them if I could and again thank you for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe thank you